Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. This is Rusty78609 inside of my Casita RV, 17 feet long, 84 square feet inside. And what you see in front of you is a Cosori, C O S O R I, original electric glass kettle. Why do I have that? Because my glass teapot broke. So I threw that old glass teapot away that I've had for about six years. And I got this just to boil water. Why do I boil water? Well, I pour it over some tea bags in the morning to make my tea. And then I pour it over my breakfast, which is oatmeal, blueberries, chia seeds, uh, flaxseed powder. Uh, and then I add, after I pour the hot water on it and let it soak for a while, I add, uh, what? Yogurt and bananas, and that's my breakfast. So I need something to boil water that's pretty. So I got this thing and guess what? <laughs> You'll love this. This is it's really neat. And why? Watch this. See this is the on off switch right here. It comes fully assembled. There's nothing to assemble. You just need to read the instructions so you understand that the first thing you need to do is to boil a, a, a full tank of water. You, know, you fill it up to max and boil it. That's just to clean it out on the inside. And then you pour that out and you're ready to go. But let me show you something. This is the on-off switch over here. This little tab sticking out here. And also this thing here pops up the lid. I say it pops up the lid like that. Okay, that does that. So anyway, but to turn it on, you just pop. And look at that. <laughs> See that blue light? There's a blue circle that comes on all the way around there. And then and after a few seconds, you'll see some little bubbles form in there and stuff. Yeah, it's freaking awesome. It's kind of entertaining. Actually, it doesn't take much to entertain me. I'm 74 years old, and ain't nothing in here but me. But having said that, guys, so if you need, just need to boil water quickly, uh, this thing will work. Uh, because I did test it with a smaller amount just a while ago just to see. And it does a pretty good job. And also, it has an automatic cutoff. Do I like that? Yeah, I'm 74 years old. Do I forget things on the on the stove occasionally? I have. I haven't in a long time, but I have. And the older I get, the more chance the, there's more opportunity that's going to happen. So what I've got here, this thing, once the water is boiling, it cuts off. It also has another safety feature in that if if it did happen to stay on when there and when it identifies there's no water in the deal, it cuts off. So there's no uh, fire hazard. You know what I mean? But yeah, you see there. You see the bubbles already coming up. Let me show you. I just turned it on. That's a full pot. But it, there's already bubbles coming up. I mean, this thing heats, baby. But yeah, do I like that? Yeah, sure. I mean, it's pretty. It, it, but the good thing about it, it fits uh, in my, my casita pretty well. Because down here, I have a spot for it. Right here. Right in here. It'll just lay right over there so that it, uh, it won't get broken when I'm traveling. I put a towel under it. or wrap it in a towel. That's what I did with my teapot, and it still got cracked. So I'll have to do better, I guess. But having said that, for you guys that need to boil water, get you a Kasori electric glass kettle. It's 1.7 liters, and you can get it on Amazon, and I'll link, leave a link in the description. And if you use the link and go there and buy something, it doesn't cost you a penny uh, to use the link. So think about it. Anyway, thumbs up. Carpe diem. Adios. Bye-bye. Buy anything you want. Buy you a Kasori if you want to. Drink plenty of water. Stretch walk. Stand guard at the door of your mind. Keep your health. Or, and whatever you, else you need to do, enjoy your life. And uh, for you guys in Texas, I feel sorry for you because I'm one of them. And right now here in near Llano, Texas, it's about 98 degrees and hot. But having said that, my Kasori little electric glass kettle works. So adios amigos. Bye-bye.